Hey YouTube, Sandy Frank here. Today's uh, video, I wanted to do another vintagey junk wax era type uh, baseball card pack opening. And this is actually a set I've never opened a single pack of in my entire life. I did not collect baseball cards in 1993. This is a, a 1993 Series Tops Baseball. It says you get a Tops Gold baseball card in every pack. And it's new premium quality. So... That's what the pack looks like. At this point in time, they got away from using like actual wax. This is like a, a, a cellophane type pack, except it's like sealed like a wax pack. So let's see what we get. Pretty excited. I've never opened this before. And of course, you can get these really cheap um, compared to modern, uh, the new stuff that comes out. I wonder if they have, yeah, they don't leave any residue on the back the cards like a wax pack is. Okay. Oh. Hmm. So we got some backwards cards here. Okay, we'll go like this. Oh, there's our gold right off the bat. It's Dante Bichette. That's uh, the father of Bo Bichette. I wonder if that's a rookie card. No, definitely not. Um, we got Butch Henry. We've got 1992 Tops All-Stars. Tom Glavin and Dave Fleming. That's pretty cool. We've got managers. Kevin Kennedy and Jim Riggleman. We've got draft pick Dave Landecker. Pretty badly off off center there, but I remember uh, in in uh, archives they do some rookie cards like this sometimes, like flashback to that style. Uh, more managers: Lou Pinella and Joe Torre, Lance Parrish. Didn't know he played for the Mariners. Paul Quantrill. This is the 1993 Topps design. Pretty basic. Um, I mean, it's a nice picture on there. You got a border, but just the name. It is easy to read the name, and you got the team name, but no, no team logos. Um, so kind of a real basic looking design. The card back is pretty nice, full color card back. Um, Craig Biggio. Man, there's something on the card right there. Pat Listoch, um, All-Star Rookie Cup. Ozzie Guillen. Kent Bottenfield. Shane Turner. Mike Trombley. And Mike Bordick. All right. So I think maybe Craig Biggio was a Hall of Famer out of this pack. But that was the card that had the, the weird uh, like damage on the the edge there or like a bleed over right there so interesting i mean there maybe some of these managers were hall of famers like lou Pinella, joe torrey joe torrey i don't know if he's hall of fame but and we have a tops gold dante bichette i like the tops gold that's kind of cool you got one of those every pack they were starting to experiment with parallels at this time all right thank you for watching stay tuned for more videos later